Well, a new movie is playing exclusively in our area, and it's out of this world. You'll be able to see it in downtown Sacramento. ABC 10's Mark S. Allen checked it out last night. We think he likes it. So, Mark, uh, there's some pretty big-name stars in this one, right? Yeah, by not so much names, but big stars in this movie. You know, it's not bigger than Barbie. You're not going to get Margot Robbie, but you are going to get, let's just say, the entire universe and beyond. Take a look. A telescope is a time machine. That's Oscar-winning actress Michelle Williams, the voice of Deep Sky, a new movie detailing the creation of and images captured by NASA's Webb Telescope. This telescope has transformed the night. Last night, in an exclusive preview featuring NASA scientists, astronauts, and its director, local educators got to see it first. Teachers like Ruth DeLimas from Woodlands Plainfield Elementary. <laughs> Ruth, I saw you beaming with this ended. What are you most excited about? And what's awesome about it? What was awesome about it was to see a group of people coming together for so long to put together this huge project and for it to go off without a hitch. I mean, they had some hiccups, but to see teamwork, because that's something we work on in our classroom. Now, Oscar-nominated director about Nathaniel Kahn responsible for bringing you know, it to Sacramento. Humans, for as long as we've had thought, cognitive thought, we've wondered, where are we from? This sure. telescope is probably going to be our best bet of figuring that out. Oh, it is. I mean, that's why it was built. You know, the initial reason to build this telescope was to reach the, you know, reach the edge of the universe. We know that the universe is about 13.8 billion years old, um, and it is able to see back to as close to the very beginnings of the universe um, as we've ever seen before. And already, and we're just getting this, you know, this is like a Ferrari, and it's in first gear, right? So, you know, it, it's it's got a long way to go, but already we have seen further back in time and further out into space, and those two things are intimately connected than ever before. Than ever before, 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 before. Like I said, the movie is more of an experience than a movie, highly educational. And during this time where we talk about movies that are three and a half hours long or longer, this one's only 40 minutes long, but I promise it's going to leave your jaw on the floor, as it did with these educators last night. Students, educators, all of us can enjoy it now exclusively at the Esquire IMAX Theater. That's the largest IMAX screen west of the Mississippi. In case you didn't know, back to you. Uh, is it just me? Am I the only one that gets motion sickness at IMAX? Do you get that too? Because to me, it's a, <laughs> I struggle with that. No, he doesn't. There's your answer. He does not. All right. Thank you, Mark. Appreciate it.